Nigeria, Lagos, Lucky Deep Sea Port. The Lucky Port comprises of two container berths, one tugboat dock, a 2.7 kilometer breakwater and shore protection, a harbor basin, a 9 kilometer channel, and 470,000 square meters of hinterland. It has the capacity to accommodate 18,000 20-foot equivalent unit container ships, and its annual design throughput is 1.2 million 20-foot equivalent units. The main purpose of Lucky Port is to provide import and export cargo services for Nigeria and its neighboring countries. It has modern terminals, cargo storage facilities, and logistics support facilities, which enable it to handle various types of cargo, including containers, petroleum, and natural gas. Additionally, it has an efficient logistics system and communication network, ensuring efficient and safe cargo transportation. Lekki Deep Sea Port is one of Nigeria's national strategic projects, launched in 2006, with the aim of becoming a commercial and logistics center in West Africa. The project is a joint venture between the Nigerian government and China Harbor Engineering Company Limited and Talarum from Singapore. With a total investment exceeding $1.5 billion, the construction of the Lekki Port project began in June 2020, was completed in October 2022, and commenced commercial operations in January 2023. The largest shareholder of the Lekki Port project is China Harbor Engineering Company, which originally served as the project CPC contractor. However, Financing difficulties and changes in the external economic situation in 2015 caused the project to slow down. To speed up the project, CHEC injected $221 million into the port company, transforming from an EPC contractor to a strategic investor and becoming the largest shareholder. Subsequently, China Development Bank provided a big loan of $629 million US dollars for the port's construction, aiming to make Nigeria the country with the largest population in Africa, a logistics center in the region. After completion, the French Container Shipping and Maritime Company, CMACGM, is responsible for the daily operations and management of the port. Nigeria, the largest economy in Africa and adjacent to the Gulf of Guinea, heavily rallies in shipping as its primary means of international trade. Lagos Port, the busiest and largest port in West Africa, handles the majority of Nigeria's national import and export cargo. However, the port's aging infrastructure cannot meet the demands of Nigeria's rapidly developing economy, leading to high logistics costs that rank among the highest in Africa and the world. The outdated facilities of Lagos Port, coupled with the lack of modernized surrounding roads and insufficient container handling capacity, have resulted in long cargo delays at the port, which have now become a common occurrence. Previously, Nigerian ports could only accommodate ships of approximately 30,000 tons, due to a maximum water depth of about 13 meters, leading to exorbitant freight prices. After the completion of Lekki Deep Seaport, Lagos will become a shipping and logistics center in Central and Western Africa, effectively unleashing Nigeria's economic development potential and increasing national income. Lekki Port is also one of the largest deep water ports in West Africa. During its 45-year concession period, it is expected to bring a total economic benefit of 361 billion US dollars to Nigeria, which is more than 200 times the port construction cost. It will create nearly 200,000 job opportunities and pay out 19 billion US dollars in wages to local workers during the 45-year period, greatly improving the living standards of local residents. Currently, Lekki Port already has thousands of local employees, with more than 80% of technical and management positions being localized through systematic training and guidance, and local employees have mastered more professional and modern work skills. In addition, the construction of Lekki Deep Sea Port will also facilitate the growth of Nigeria's import and export trade, as well as other industries, thereby driving local economic growth and development. The operation of Lekki Port will pave the way for a new economic development paradigm in Nigeria, effectively promoting the export of local products, particularly agricultural products, 
and increasing the country's foreign exchange earnings. Moreover, the port will create numerous employment opportunities, thus aiding the Nigerian government in achieving its poverty reduction targets. After the Leki Deep Sea port becomes operational, it is expected to transform into one of the most advanced and efficient ports in sub-Saharan Africa, becoming a pivotal force driving Nigeria's economic growth. Moreover, the Leki port will exemplify the benefits of multi-party cooperation and win-win partnerships, leveraging the strengths of Nigeria, China, and France to foster the development of the port and its associated industries. Neighboring countries of Nigeria, including Nigeria and Chad, as well as Mali, located further away, have reaped benefits from the Leki Deep Sea Port. These countries recognize that the port's existence can lead to lower logistics costs, increased efficiency, and improved domestic economic development. Mali has even expressed a strong interest in using the Leki Deep Sea Port as a trade route for importing and exporting goods. Leki Deep Sea Port is a collaborative effort between the Nigerian government, state-owned enterprises, Chinese companies, and Singaporean companies. The French company CMACGM is responsible for managing the port's daily operations. The project also receives financing, design, consulting, and other services from companies across the globe, demonstrating an exemplary model of global solidarity and cooperation. Despite some voices of opposition that label this a debt trap, they overlook the remarkable profit potential of Leckie Port in the future. Once operational, Leckie Port will aid in elevating Lagos to a transit hub in West and Central Africa, with an expected total economic benefit of nearly 361 billion US dollars for Nigeria, with an investment return of up to 200 times. Furthermore, the financing model of this project involves multi-party joint investment, alleviating any concerns the Nigerian government may have about debt or guarantee risks. Leckie the location of Leki Deep Sea Port is a new key development area within the Lagos metropolitan area. Nigerians have ambitious plans to transform Leki into a shining pearl on the Atlantic coast, including the following initiatives. Leki Free Trade Zone, covering approximately 155 square kilometers, this modern city within a city can accommodate up to 120,000 permanent residents. It integrates industry, commerce, real estate development, warehousing and logistics, tourism, and entertainment, other parts of the Lecky Deep Sea Port project. The first phase of the port has already been operationalized, and the entire project will double the port's current size. Railway Connection Project A railway line from the port to Ijeb Road is in the planning stage, with an expected investment of $800 million. Lekki Epi International Airport This super airport, designed to handle 5 million passengers per year, a futuristic airport will be built with an expected investment of 450 millions of dollars. Atlantic Coast Hotel and Resort Area A cluster of the best luxury resorts and casinos in Africa will be built here, making it the most sought-after tourist destination in West Africa. New Residential Areas the proposed land use master plan for Leki envisages the peninsula as a blue-green environment city, expected to accommodate well over a residential population of 3.4 million, in addition to a non-residential population of at least 1.9 million. If this ambitious plan is realized, Leki will become one of the top 10 cities in Africa, and Leki will expand the size of the Lagos metropolitan area by one-third. With these ambitious plans, Nigerians envisioned that Leki will become the fastest growing corridor in West Africa. To achieve these ambitious goals, a lot of money and a strong partner with excellent infrastructure capabilities are needed. As expected, China is the best partner for this. Nigerians have made the right choice 